glycemic index in their food. Um, a lot of people who have diabetes running in their family that are younger that are now realizing that you know it's never too early to make changes. So we're seeing them um, quite an influx of young people coming in that are opting more for desserts that are fleet, uh, sweetened with xylitol and stevia. We have a line of um, diabetic friendly chocolates that we try to have in stock every day. And uh, Zach, our chef, is really trying to create more desserts that have a very low glycemic index. We've we definitely use a lot of um, Michigan maple syrup and raw honey, but we're trying to move more into focusing on, um, you know, lower glycemic fruits like blueberries. You know, using primarily stevia and xylitol to, you know, lend that flavor of sweetness without without having that spike on the um, on the sugar. So, you know, agave nectar is pretty controversial, so we're really trying to move away from using that. A lot of coconut nectar we do use here. It's similar to brown rice syrup, but it's really kind of thick and sticky. It's a little bit challenging to work with compared to agave nectar, but with the new research that's coming out with agave, we're, we're really trying to fix it out. Living in paradise